Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to either enable or disable video input in the Windows Sandbox. So the Windows Sandbox is optimized to boot up your computer faster. And, and I'm going to show you guys just basically how to enable or disable this video input from being displayed. So pretty straightforward process guys, and we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. And we're going to start by opening up the start menu. Just soft click on the start button at one time. Type in regedit, so R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best result should come back with registry editor. Right click on that and select run as administrator. If you're prompted with a user account control screen, go ahead and select yes. Now before we proceed in the registry, like all my registry videos, I would suggest you create a backup of it. So worst case scenario, you made a mistake and needed to revert it back, you can. And in order to create the backup, it's very simple. Just go ahead and left click on the file tab and then select export. File name, I'd recommend naming it the date in which you are making the backup. Export range should be kept at all and then save it to a convenient location on your computer. And then you just would go ahead and select save if you ever needed to retrieve it at some point. You would go and select file and then import and navigate to that said file location. So you could do an external media drive, you save it somewhere on your computer, it doesn't really matter. Probably somewhere external would probably be a smarter choice, but you know, everybody can do whatever they prefer. But anyway, we're ready to begin. So double click on the HK local machine folder. Do the same thing now for the software folder. Same thing for policy, so expand that. Same thing for Microsoft. Uh, same thing for Windows. And then finally, there should be a sandbox folder. If you need to pause the video at this time, you can see the file path up at the top of the registry editor screen here. Each backslash indicates a different subfolder we've gone under up to this point, so it should be pretty self-explanatory, I would say. And now on the right side, you want to right-click in a blank area, select New, and then select DWORD 32-bit value. You want to name this value exactly how it appears on my screen here. It's going to be Allow video input exactly how it appears the first letter of each word should be capitalized no spaces in between any of these words so again allow video input hit enter on your keyboard now that you've done that if you want to enable video input for the Windows sandbox go ahead and double click on it you want to set it to 1 if you want to disable video input you want to set it to a 0 so number 0 you're turning it off you're disabling it setting it to number one will enable it and make sure base is hexadecimal as well so go select OK once you made whatever change is your preference and you can close out the registry editor and that should pretty much be about it guys would suggest restarting your computer in order for that to actually take effect and that should be it so as always thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial I do hope that I was able to help you out, and as always, thanks for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.